Hey hello guys welcome to mtech viral in this series of tutorial what I am going to do I am going to teach you how you can uh, start programming so there might be some people that uh, who wants to learn programming but they don't get uh, enough you know uh, they can't uh, able to learn from the teachers in their colleges or you can say that they don't get uh, that much resources to learn the programming and they don't even know how to start with the programming so this series of tutorials or you can say this course is basically for those who want to start programming or for those who have uh, learned some programming but uh, want to learn a different uh, you can say different language so this tutorial is for those people so I'm going to uh, tell you how can you do programming in a new language which is Kotlin this language is still in beta but uh, definitely very soon you can uh, see this language in a stable version but uh, this is in beta and it's working very fine um, but there are some changes going on with this Kotlin but uh, you don't be uh, you want you won't be affected that much because of those changes so why Kotlin this is the first question you uh, are going to ask so you can see here on the screen that it is a statically typed programming language for the JVM so JVM is basically Java virtual machine and Android and the browser and 100% interoperable with Java so what does that mean that uh, basically you can say that Kotlin is based on Java but uh, the uh, there is some advantages of Kotlin so they, these are some advantages that it is concise you don't have to write that much boilerplate code in like Java Java is a little difficult for you if you are a starter because there are some concepts that uh, that will take some time and uh, if you are like me then uh, it will be very difficult for you to learn programming because uh, I, I haven't done anything when I start uh, the programming and uh, the loops and all that was just went out of my mind and uh, I don't know how I uh, went through that time so we were talking about the advantages of Kotlin so first one is cons it is concise it is safe uh, why it is safe because uh, if you are a Java programmer then you must be knowing that uh, value of that uh, null pointer exception or you can say that uh, there are a lot of null pointer exceptions in every situation so Kotlin um, almost eliminate that thing so, and third one is it is a versatile so what you can do you can do java programming here you can make android apps with this and you can also make server side application and it is interoperable because you know that java can uh, work on any environment on any operating system so similarly it is also use the libraries of the jvm and uh, so this is 100 percent java interoperability provides so this is Kotlin and why I am starting with Kotlin because it is a uh, good you can say that uh, if you uh, have heard about Swift then uh, you, you must be knowing that Swift is for iOS so you can say that this is the Swift for Android so this is Kotlin for you and uh, believe me you will love this piece of tutorial uh, which I will start from the next uh, video and uh, if you really want to learn programming then believe me I'll teach you from my point of view I, and I'm just assuming that you don't know anything about programming you just know simple mathematics of addition subtraction and all. so I'm going to begin it with this with the next videos and uh, if you are liking this videos of uh, mtech viral then you can like this video too and uh, you can subscribe to my channel for future updates so please press the red button and subscribe the channel to motivate me for more such videos thank you so much